Hello, this is meteorologist Matt Walters with the National Weather Service in Topeka, Kansas. Here's a weather briefing concerning the potential for another winter storm to hit the area. After having finished digging out of the most recent winter storm, another one is taking aim at central and eastern Kansas, which is expected to impact the region late Sunday night into Tuesday morning. There remains some uncertainty with the track of the storm as weather models try to get a handle on it, but winter precipitation is likely and could initially come down in the form of freezing rain and snow Sunday night across parts of eastern Kansas. However, this is expected to be short-lived with all areas changing over to snow by Monday afternoon. The most intense part of the storm is likely to occur during the day Monday and into Tuesday morning. As the storm intensifies, strong north winds may gust over 30 miles an hour, leading to near whiteout conditions as well as drifting of the snow. Because of this potential for winter weather to impact the area, winter storm watches have been posted from the Oklahoma and Texas panhandles through central and eastern Kansas beginning Sunday evening and continuing through Monday night. As I had mentioned, the most uncertainty occurs with the track of the storm, and here's one model showing its track and the precipitation associated with the winter storm. By 6 a.m. Monday, the storm system is centered over the Red River Valley between Oklahoma and Texas, with precipitation developing across central Kansas. As we step forward in time, by noon Monday, that storm system is making slow progress to the east into southeast Oklahoma, with the heaviest precipitation now moving into east central and southeast Kansas. By Monday evening, the storm system is still making slow progress into Arkansas, with heavy precipitation remaining over eastern Kansas. By two, midnight Tuesday, it's finally starting to move into southern Missouri, with the heaviest precipitation still persisting over east central Kansas and lasting into Tuesday morning 6 a.m. The likely impacts from this winter storm are minor accumulations of ice as precipitation falls as freezing rain initially. The heaviest snowfall looks to occur during the day Monday and Monday night. Strong north winds could cause near whiteout conditions and drifting snowbanks, potentially closing roads. This would make travel Sunday night into Tuesday difficult. At this time, areas along and south of Interstate 70 appear to be most favorable to receive the brunt of the storm. However, the exact track of this storm could change the location of the heaviest precipitation, so it is important to keep up to date with the latest forecast information. This concludes the weather briefing. You can keep up to date with the evolving winter storm at weather.gov forward slant Topeka. Follow the National Weather Service on Facebook and Twitter for updates to the forecast as well.